Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Hobie with Don't You Freestyle Garage Barbecue. I wanted to do a double down from KFC without the breading, of course. And the double down is basically two pieces of chicken meat acting as the bread. And uh, in between it, bacon and cheese and whatnot. So let's get started. Before my hands get dirty, check out this, this spice I'm going to be using. This uh, is from Con Jaeger. And I think I bought it last year. Uh, it's uh, spiced rock salt and it's Mediterranean style uh, it's gonna be pretty good on here but I'm gonna use it in conjunction with their um, their seasoning I'm sorry their Cajun seasoning and blackened spice uh, so I'm gonna be using both of these so let's get the chicken thighs prepared gonna cut these puppies in half Yeah, so I went on a keto style, at least a low carb diet. Um, I think this is about the eighth day. I don't look at the calendar too much and I don't look at the scales either. But um, it seems to be going good. My clothes are fitting better already. I can feel it in my neck, in different areas that uh, the weight's coming off. And I don't think it's just water weight either. I think it really is some weight. But uh, I just mentioned that because most of what I've been doing on video here is, is almost no carb. So what you want to do here is just even out these thighs, I'm sorry, these breasts so that they will cook evenly and also so they'll be easier to make a, a sandwich type concoction out of it. And the tin foil is going to help not squirt juice everywhere, which can be very dangerous when you're dealing with chicken. And at this point is where the freestyle portion comes in. I wanted to create my own sauce to go with this uh, chicken and bacon double down concoction. And uh, so what I did was I made, some, made a mistake. So that's why you're not going to see the ingredients listed anywhere below because I wouldn't recommend the sauce. Um, I will perfect it. And then when I do, I'll, I'll make a short video for those out there who, who like rubs or sauces. But what I was going for here was uh, salty, some heat, and some tang. And so I just put in the usual ingredients in, in the incorrect amount, I guess, is what, what happened. But the usual ingredients, some mayo, some hot mustard, a little bit of ketchup there, some hot sauce. There's uh, soy sauce right there. And there was a the problem the, coming up right here is the pickle. I put too much pickle juice in there. And it overpowered the sauce instead of giving it a smorgasbord of flavors it was just basically a rich to, uh, pickle sauce but at this point i'm gonna I, I try it without it being on the chicken because sometimes the sauce can taste different alone than it would on the food so even though i'm not happy with it right here i'm still going to try it on the chicken a little bit later Sizzle. For the bacon part of it, I removed the left side grill grate and replaced it with a, the Weber 7566 porcelain 
enameled cast iron griddle uh, specifically made for my Weber uh, E310 and so on the other side I am putting the chicken on the grate So the chicken took about 20 minutes, but uh, time is gonna vary for each person depending on their grill, how many times they open it, how cold it is outside, uh, several factors. But just make sure you cook your chicken to 165 degrees Fahrenheit uh, internally to be safe. Well, there it is. Wish me luck on building it. So somebody out there didn't wish me luck because I didn't even film my reaction to it. It uh, just was not, it wasn't good. So uh, I abandoned that and went back to the drawing board. I, the, the sauce is officially a no-go. So that's what you get when you freestyle. Trial and error, sauce fail. Anyways, we take, it bit, take it into the house here and I'm going to go with some Harvati cheese and good old ranch. Uh, just nuke that cheese real quick to let it melt and uh, we'll try it this way. So it's officially very very good. I would really recommend this. It's a very nice low carb keto style sandwich or meal so give it a shot hope you guys like the video thanks for stopping by